county uh, nikiang nikiangalia mada ya kwanza what is the theme of Raila's rally tomorrow unajua sisi wa Kenya we are poor listeners Raila has called for a political rally Raila has not called for a demonstration Raila has not called for maandamano leo nimesikia Rigathi Gashagwa himself Rigathi Gashagwa anasema ati Raila ameitisha maandamano Raila has called for a political rally Mr Rigathi Gashagwa if you don't understand English Raila called for a political rally sio maandamano and if you are panicking tell us why you are panicking about Raila's rally That is number one. Aya, as is Azimio reducing to ODM party. Wa Kenya mimi nataka kuambia ya kwamba unaona wale watu wote wa wenye walikuwa Azimio wameenda kufanya kazi na serikali. Wamepeleka tumbo. Si ati Azimio imekufa, Azimio bado iko. Iko. Nani? Kalonzo bado ako Azimio. Mata Karua bado ako Azimio. Kioni bado wako azimio. Raila na ODM yake bado iko azimio. Hadi uhuru. Wewe hey. unataka kutuambia azimio imekufa na kesho tuko na rally. Ilikuwa rally ya UDA ama rally ya azimio? Kesho tuko na rally ya azimio la umoja coalition. Sio ODM. ODM is under the umbrella of azimio. Azimio is still live and kicking. Thank you. Thank you. Aya. <laughs> ya tatu. Ya tatu. Is it right for the deputy president to promote peace and cohesion among MCAs across the country? According to the Kenyan's constitution, Katiba ya Kenya. Deputy president, the work of the deputy president is to deputize the president. What deputy president is doing now is called a delegation of responsibility that he has been delegated by the president. Executive order. It is called executive order. He has no mandate to walk around the country to bring unity among the MCAs. Ni ile tu kazi ameambiwa wewe enda Northeast anambia wale watu wafanye hivyo. Enda Nyanza lakini Nyanza akikuja lazima tuulize. Lazima tuambie. Yes. 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 Is an executive order out of the constitution or within the constitution? It is not in the constitution. It is the same as wewe unaweza kuwa kama nyamaza kwanza, nyamaza kwanza. Wana watu waelewe because watu wamesema mambo ya executive order. Where is this executive order coming from? The executive order comes from the chairman of the executive who is the president. The president is the chair and the leader of the executive. Dakika moja, waje ni kueleze dakika moja. We have three arms of government. We have three arms of government. Yes. I want us I want us to understand. Yes. I want us to understand something here. Before the president gives an executive order, where does he get that power to execute that executive order? That is what I want. Where does he get that power? We have the power of the executive which is being chaired by the from the executive members. He is a member of the executive. <laughs> Tunasema you are taking me back to social studies or geography or history. We have three arms of government. We have the judiciary, we have the legislature and we have the executive. The judiciary is headed by the 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 the, 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 the judge who is Martha Kome being assisted. Unaona? Ukienda kwa executive the president is the head of the executive. He is the one who chairs all the meetings of the executive. Ana zaambia nani kiture kindiki enda leta mani huko ama enda ukuwe na enda northeastern uonge na hao watu. He is the one to delegate those responsibilities. It is not in there. So, Santi. Nimemaliza. Haya, lakima ijudie waache kupani.